Hello and welcome to my home. My name is Jackie. I have a box. I have a very important box. I have the You Blew Your Budget for the Year box. Not the one item, but because this one item equals four in a month, the same month. Yeah. So, yeah. I did a wish list for 2024. I had one bag on there from this brand. I now have four. And, uh, yeah. We're good. We're good. Um, no more. No more. I have to stop. I keep telling myself that. So, anyway, we're going to open the box. This came all the way from Oklahoma. It actually arrived here yesterday, but it has a signature receipt because of insurance, and I wasn't able to get to the post office. I missed it by five minutes. Um, so we are opening it now. And this, I'm so excited to buy this, or to get this. I have no idea what this bag is from, but it's a cool bag. She put it in this dust bag. Cor Corazon. But this is the... Yeah. Everything I wanted her to be. Everything. I am going to live in this bag. I might even actually have to live in her for more than a day because I know I change my bags every day so this is the soft Ricky guys this is the soft Ricky this belonged to the the lady who I bought this from this is her bag she's the only owner her husband bought it for her after a Vegas trip and um there's some flaws this is not a perfect bag this is I got this off Poshmark um so it wasn't inexpensive but it wasn't the you know current market value for these bags because these are these bags retail for around three thousand dollars guys so this is the soft ricky and uh ralph lauren as you know my favorite bag company right now so i'm just trying to get this belt to it opens so i can un unbelt it so there's some there's some flaws on here and i knew this from the photos so and that reflected in the price right so there is some rubbing here there's some flaws like this is bent up but that's fine it's normal this is a bit there's some there's a little bit of a scuffing here there is this there's some scuffing on the bottom but this is really nice they have a a, 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 a thicker kind of cap here to help with the corners because this is a peb more pebbled over here so this is more smooth it has a great bottom there's some wear on all of the corners actually here's here's a little bit of wear there which happens with a blue bag it happens with any bag this is a big bag you carry it on your shoulder you're gonna bang into things this is what just happens so let me take out some stuffing So this is the entire bag. There is a little bit of tear in the lining right there. Not tear, but scuffing of the lining it is a leather lined. So just by having friction and things in there. So this is a well-loved, well-used. This, this bag did not sit on someone's shelf. Somebody, she used this bag. So I'm going to actually put that button there so it doesn't she used the pocket it's you know there's some staining right here from an ink pen um not pristine guys there's scuffing here but guys my all-in purchase for this rookie bag was 540 which is a lot because i already bought this is my fourth rookie in in, in one month in one month so i can't buy any more bags like i keep saying that but there's a reality and the reality is i have to stop i have to start paying for these things um so no did i buy this for cash no i use this um i use a credit card to buy this so now i need to pay that back because i'm now paying interest on this so that's part of the issue when you make these life decisions that are not always the best is that there's life consequences and my life consequences is to get this amazing blue bag in the color way i wanted at the time i wanted it instantaneously without having saved the money at first it's now that i have to pay it off and pay interest but that's what you do sometimes and unfortunately um so now i have a gold ricky a brown ricky uh, the red one you can see above me and this blue one 
So, and hopefully with this blue one, I can stop obsessing and I can move on because I don't want to get, I wanted to get a, a full size Ricky in the heavier leather, but I'm actually happy I have this one because this is a soft Ricky. So this is a lighter weight bag than the full Ricky. Um, but the one thing I don't like about bags like this is the asymmetrical crossbody. So I'm going to have to probably use extenders because I have to on every bag I have. There's a lot of wear on this um, strap, more so than any part of the bag. Because, again, the person who owned this bag used this bag. You know, she used the heck out of it. And she's probably ready to maybe... I, I find that people who sell... Um, the best prices I've seen on the Rickies have been for the red ones and the blue ones. And I think, well, first, I gravitate towards those colors. But second is because... Um, yeah, I'm going to have to get an extender on this because the way this sits on me is not the most attractive it needs to be about four inches a little lower because of the handles because of this and then as a crossbody i can wear it but this is not this is not the best look i mean i can wear it as a shoulder bag but that's not how i wear these bags i want to be able to carry this because they're going to put things in here i want it to be able to carry so this is going to be my new work bag i'm going to use this for work um i might i might stop um changing out all my bags as often because I want to give this one a really good run for its money. I might try using this for the rest of the week, which is not that long because today is a Tuesday. So I can I can wear it all the way till Friday. And then on my Friday live, I'm going to um give you a review on how I feel about this one. So my other Ricky I have is also a soft Ricky, but it's in gold. And it's a metallic gold, so it's very um, festive and a little bit more, um, a lot more neutral, because you can wear a gold Ricky with anything, right? But it's a little bit more flashy. I think this is a little bit more subtle, even though it's a bright royal blue, because I'm always wearing blue. And honestly, people don't know what Rickies are especially we don't have a Ralph Lauren store in our area we the only Ralph Lauren we have is like the Ralph Lauren outlet or we'll have um I don't even think um I've never been into an actual Ralph Lauren boutique so that's one of my bucket lists of things to do someday is to go find one and just tour walk around look but I'm hoping this satisfies this satisfies my need for the I need this in blue because Blue is my favorite color, and I've seen several blue, and I'm actually happy to get this one because it's two types of blue. It's this, you know, it's the dark navy with the royal versus um, the ones I've been looking at are light blue, and I've seen some lavender bags on the Free Love Free Love market, but this one was too good of a, a deal, um, so I got it for, you know, as I said, five fifty dollars or something around that. It was $500 um, price, and then you had to add in tax and, tax and shipping, so I am... I am more than happy to have this. I'm going to start using it. I'm going to move my stuff into it right now. I was using this bag today because I, I wore a blue dress. I actually had changed into a different bag. And uh, this is the book I'm reading. This is the Ralph Lauren book I'm reading. So very appropriate. I needed a, a bag that could fit my um, my book. And this this is actually what i carry around from bag to bag and that's all that's in here and i'm going to put this all that now goes in here now the book i'm not going to put in there because i'm going to you know actually leave that out and read it so this is what i take to work so i'm just going to go ahead and close this like that and I just leave it locked like that and I don't actually carry them with the straps um through the bag at all I don't really um, envision myself doing the whole thing you know I might just actually leave them inside the bag completely not even out and I'll leave the wings out I kind of like to look with the wings out you can um have them so that they cinch in that's why the loops are there so you can belt them through so it looks like that a little bit more streamlined um like this 
So this is called the Ricky Bag, guys. There's many different versions. There is a soft. This is the soft. There's a regular, which will have the metal exposed here. Um, they have it in neutral colors, in red colors, and white colors. Um, I think the a beautiful oxblood color. It is an absolutely amazing bag. I am so thrilled and honored to own it, especially for this lady who who bought it because she's 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 really cool. <laughs> she's she was really nice to me. I didn't put an offer in. I just bought it at the list price. I thought it was a very fair price. Normally I try to negotiate, but that bag's like twenty five hundred, three thousand dollars brand new, and she sold it to me for and I'll tell you the exact number. Um, this is on Poshmark. It was for $548.81, and that is why I have now banned from buying bags, because I bought four, four in one month. So yeah, I probably could have bought one from Ralph Lauren, but I bought four, and um, yeah, two of them I, two of them I bought outright, one is on payment plan, the red one, and this one I bought on a credit card, which is essentially a payment plan, because it's not paid for yet, um, and no, I'm not one of those people who pay off their you know, credit cards at the end of the month. I, I, I can't, I don't. So, um, I wish, but anyway, um, I'm going to read the show detail. Let me read, if I can read you the original listing, it just lists and it shows all the flaws. So this is not unknown. Um, all color that looks amazing in I think she meant to say all seasons, cross strap, optional, bright silver hardware, dark navy sides with a bright blue, 100% leather, pre, pre, um, pre loved with well, hers, which means that, um, because I asked her, she said it was her bag. It's always been her bag. And, um, so anyhow, that is how this goes. And I'm going to accept the order. Everything looks fantastic. It, it was listed for a while. The first communication was in November and I purchased it in February. So it had been hanging around for several so for several months. And I think a lot of it had to do with one the color cuz it's bright blue uh, which I love but not everybody loves and it was the condition. People who want to buy these bags want them perfect. I don't perfect is overrated. I want to be able to use my bag. I will put more, I will put more scuffs on this bag so at least I can uh wear it with joy and know that it's fine if it gets more scuffs. So anyhow, thank you for watching my video. Thank you for Birkin Boy, my enabler best friend, um, for getting me down the rabbit hole. He's the one who introduced me to, I've always liked Ralph Lauren, but I didn't know about Ralph Lauren um, more than just clothing and polo. And I knew they had bags. My sister has a bag. I'm still trying to wrestle out of her closet. Um, I had never or had a bag, so I have been buying Ralph Lauren um, like crazy. Not just the Ricky bag, which is their high, high end. I buy all the bags. Like, here's one right here. Um, as you see my channel, uh, it's just growing. I love this bag. This is also a Ralph Lauren bag. So Ralph Lauren comes in several tiers and levels. There's Ralph Lauren Polo, Lauren by Ralph Lauren, um, RLL. You see them anywhere from high-end stores to like Neiman Marcus to, well, I'm assuming it's a Neiman Marcus. I don't shop in Neiman Marcus. I don't know if they're in Neiman Marcus, but I'm a, my assumption is they're in high-end department stores because um, why would they not be? And then... Um, then and I, I buy most of my stuff out of Macy's. So Macy's and I are friends, and they, they I know people have told me that these bags are in not these bags, but the Ralph Lauren bags are also in um, the discount stores because a lot of the department stores like Macy's they off sell their season ends or seasons so that they can't sell over to the discount store so they have partnerships and so anyhow don't discount it just because you see it everywhere don't discount it because you think well that was my mom's bag um i love this bag it, might, it was not my mother's bag my mother never carried a ralph lauren and um i think the bag is awesome anyhow have a great day thank you for watching my video and thank you craig for being my best enabler friend um and now we're going to calm down and not buy any more Rickies. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye-bye.